making art for as long as I can remember. Throughout the, my schooling I've had, I've tried to take as many art classes as I can. I've taken woodshop, photography, I'm currently in ceramics. I think it's really important to try different forms of art just to see if you like it or not. I use art as my form of self-expression. I like making art out of something you wouldn't expect art to be made out of and duct tape gives me that option. I've tried different mediums of art, but I've always been drawn back to duct tape because of that. I think for me, it's a form of self-expression because some people, they express themselves through music or sports. I express myself through art. I also find it just, um, it's a way to clear my head mm -hmm. after a long day and it just kind of relaxes me. I started making uh, duct tape wallets in 2010. I went over to a friend's house and her sister was making a wallet and I, was, I thought it was completely fascinating. So I went home and made some of my own and it got to a point where over the summer I was making two to three wallets a day. After that, my dad gave me the idea to enter something in the state fair and I did. And I remember just creating this huge flower that had a bee on it and I entered it and it got second and after that I just kind of got hooked on it. I started narrowing down what I made to just specifically wallets and purses and I started doing more elaborate designs and different trying different layouts and different weaves and to see how it would look. My first year of entering in the state fair I made a three foot flower that had a bee on it and that got second. The next year, I made a huge 3D model of a bee, which got first. The next year, uh, I made a little wallet that had a design on it, which got third. The year after that, I made a purse with a bee on it, which got second. And then this last year, I did a duct tape painting with a bee, which got second, and a woven purse that got first. Most of them were entered in the junior division for bee wear, and they were located in the agricultural building. And then I've entered a few other things in the just, I don't know what it's called. I don't know. The education building. Education building! Yeah. buy your wallet. They're not for sale. <laughs> <laughs>